Hi, thanks for stopping by. I'm so glad you're here. What does a woman mean when she says she wants romance? What is the point of romance and how do you know what gestures are romantic? The point of romance is to make a woman feel attracted to you through what you say and do. However, romantic gestures are only meaningful if you first establish respect and attraction in your relationship. I've covered a few of the traits that women find attractive, including intelligence, confidence, honesty, and integrity in past videos. Go back and watch those videos if you need ideas to increase respect and attraction in your interactions. A man who displays these important qualities will attract a woman and earn her respect and love. Then, any kind of romantic gesture that he offers is going to be seen as sweet and endearing and will be appreciated because it's coming from the man she wants. But to find the best romantic gesture to make her feel loved and understood match the style of romance to her personality. Here are the top five things you can do to give the woman in your life the romance she desires. Number one, analyze her personality. Does she enjoy relaxing at the spa or taking bubble baths? Then you know she will appreciate a massage by candlelight or visiting someplace with a private hot tub. Is she an extrovert who enjoys going out with friends or an introvert who prefers a quiet night at home? Take her and a few friends out for dancing or cook her dinner and provide a romantic movie the two of you can watch at home. Personalize the romantic experience in a way that matches up with her unique personality and your relationship. Number two, creative experiences. Try new things you think she might like. The best way to increase intimacy and bonding is to have new experiences together and create shared memories. Has she suggested something she would like to try like white water rafting or hot air ballooning? Make a note of it. Number three, be the man with the plan. Throughout her day, most women have to make hundreds of decisions. Often what she will find most romantic is to be with a man who will make the decisions about where they'll go and what they'll do on a date. It shows her that you want to be with her, please her, and help her to relax enough to feel intimate with you. Number four, progressive steps lead to success. Look at romance as a progressive process rather than one grand gesture. It starts with asking her for a date. That means you look at your schedules and find a time when you're both free and then ask her to spend time with you. Give her notice so she can anticipate and prepare mentally, emotionally, and physically to be completely present and open to bonding with you. Then tell her you will take care of the planning, but give her an idea of what to expect so she can look forward to it and prepare. This time of anticipation is very important. The bigger the event, the more time she will want to get ready. For a simple dinner date, a day or two is enough notice. But for a weekend getaway, give her two or three weeks to plan. She may want to buy a new outfit or a negligee. Number five, be prepared and positive. Be sure to fully plan, make reservations, book a room, schedule tours, massages, or other events well in advance. If you get her hopes up, you must come through, or you'll both be disappointed with the results. During the planning and execution of the date, keep a positive, loving attitude. This will add to the excitement and anticipation of your time together. During the date, keep everything light and fun. If your careful planning begins to fall apart due to weather or other unforeseen circumstances, it's important to laugh it off and be grateful that you're having this experience together. Even a ruined evening can be a bonding opportunity if you keep a positive attitude and don't complain. Continue to find the bright side in every moment and she will appreciate your efforts and your attitude. Think about it. If the person you love is trying hard to please you and things go wrong, do you focus on what went wrong or that somebody cared enough to try to make you feel special? The key concept for romance is that a romantic gesture is made to please the person you love, not to get her to have sex with you. 
If you ask a woman to dinner or buy her a gift with the sole intent of receiving sex in return, she will sense that and lose interest and respect for you. The proper mindset for romance is wanting her to know that she means the world to you. Keep in mind that romance isn't just for date night. Think of small things you can do every day to make your partner feel appreciated and loved. If you're shopping for groceries and you see a pretty bouquet of flowers you think she would enjoy, surprise her by bringing them home for her. If you're having a slow day at work, write her a love letter and mail it to her. Do a chore around the house that she hates to do herself or bring her a special coffee drink that she likes. What matters is that you thought about her and what she would like and then made it happen. It's just that easy to be an everyday romantic hero. For your homework today, I want you to think about the woman in your life and what she likes. If you're single, practice this with a friend or family member. Write down five romantic or loving gestures you can do for her this week. Or, if you've been promising a weekend getaway, start planning it now. Write out your list and then take action by making the necessary calls or doing the shopping or tasks that will make her happy. When you take on extra chores or do the planning for a date, you give her the free time to focus on relaxing and enjoying your relationship. Keep refreshing your list every time you cross something off and try adding something new. Romance never goes out of style and it is a necessary component of every long-lasting relationship. Take a moment now and let me know what is on your romance list by leaving a comment below and tell me what you want to learn more about in the upcoming videos. I'd love to hear from you. If you'd like to delight me with a loving gesture, please visit my Patreon page and consider pledging a small amount each month to join our community, receive bonus perks, and support my work. And please take a moment now and subscribe. I'll be uploading a new video every Thursday as well as occasional bonus videos. Thanks for meeting with me. We'll talk again soon. The softer side. Romance never goes out of style and it is unnecessary. Unnecessary. That's not a word. A word? Unnecessary.